you have 20 questions to prove that you are T7 ready regarding anatomy and physiology. These are most tested questions, topic you will see regarding anatomy and physiology portion of the T's. 60 and more is what you need to prove that you're ready. Let's get to it. First questions, I'm going to give you mnemonics in each of the questions and how to approach them. Read the question from the back. Primary function of erythroprotein. What is the function? Don't look at the answer. Go for the keyword. It's erythroprotein. What do you need to show? Answer the question. This is it. The E is erythrocytes. Erythrocyte is the same thing as what? RBC. EPO makes RBC. Write it down. EPO make RBC. Therefore, what is the right answer? It's not Y cell. It's RBC. It does not regulate calcium or platelet. Therefore, number two is the right answer. It's a rapid fire questions, and I want you to master them. These are our rapid fire questions. What is your score? You stop the video, answer the question, and put it in the comments. Let me know about your score. Secret bicarbonate to do what? The pancreas secret bicarbonate. The mnemonic for this. What do you think? B is for base. If it's a base, a base, this function is to neutralize an acid. I'm looking for an answer choice that talk about an acid. Neutralize stomach acid, it doesn't dissect. It doesn't digest protein. It doesn't stimulate insulin release. It doesn't absorb fat. Therefore, the right answer is number one. These are concepts I want you to master for your TIS exams regarding anatomy and physiology and practice questions when you're doing them. Next one, flexible support and smooth surface for joint movement. The key word is support and smooth. And therefore, the concept and the mnemonic is what? Island. Island is what? Airline. Airline is usually smooth line at the joint. A line is a smooth line at the joint. Therefore, this has to be highline um, uh, cartilage. These are the one you have to fill in the gap. And the key word is what? Smooth and support. And therefore, hairline is smooth line at the joint. So this is highline cartilage. Number five, ligament primarily. What do you need to know? Don't look at the answer choice. Go for the keyword the question is asking. I want you to associate it with things. Ligament, there's a big mnemonic for that. L for like. L for like to like. Therefore, bone to bone, not muscle to bone, right? That's tendon, right? Muscle to bone is tendon. But bone to bone is a ligament. And therefore, number two is the right answer. This is the way... You can answer them. Protect organs is usually skin or the rest of the bone, depending on where it's located. Which of the following are characteristics of what? Innate immunity. Select and apply. Innate is the keyword. Always go for the keyword and ask yourself, make the T's easy. Simple. Innate. What does innate mean? This is the buzz right? Instant. Anything that is instant, that means you don't have time and it's non-specific. Therefore, number one is the right answer. Respond immediately. Number two is the right answer. Require prior exposure. If it happen right away, it doesn't require prior exposure. It produces antibodies. Antibodies are for prior exposure. Involve phagocyte. That means you need the policeman to come and kill people. And that is phagocytosis. And therefore... What are the right answers? Select or apply. Non-specific, immediately, and phagocyte. One, two, and five. What is your score so far? No more says. I hope you get six out of six. But pay attention to the mnemonics and use it to answer the question. A germ line that forms the gastrointestinal system. What is the GI system? GI system is inside. Therefore, inside is endo. And therefore, what you answer choice you're looking for, endo. Outside is ecto. In between is miso, right? Therefore, our right answer is what? Is what? Endo them. These are straightforward questions. I want you to master them. Potassium and hydrogen ion are secreted by which part of the nephron? The big word is what? Secreted. And from what? 
potassium and iron. They are all hydrogen ion. Potassium and hydrogen ion. They are all iron. But the big word is secreted. And therefore, the mnemonic is based on secreted. And I said D dumps iron. Which one has a D in it? Not proximal tubal, no loop of Ellen, no Bowman's capsule. It's the distal tubal and collecting that. And therefore, those are the right answer. Number three is the right answer. You see the strategy I'm using to answer the question? That's the way I want you to do that. Same thing. Gas exchange occur in what? In the lung. This one, you have to provide an answer. I have a mnemonic for you. And what is that? Air uh, is what exchange occur. So air uh, leave via what? Avioli. 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 Therefore, the right answer is avioli. The function of what? Luteinizing hormone. Luteinizing hormone, love hormones. Therefore, that's the mnemonic. What are you going to use? Love hormones. And therefore, which one? Stimulate thyroid hormone. You know thyroid hormone has to start with the T. You trigger ovulation and testosterone. Even if you don't know, keep that one. Promote milk production. Milk production is not the hormone. Increase calcium absorption. It's not the hormone. I say love hormones. Trigger ovulation and testosterone. It looks like testosterone production is hormone. And then trigger ovulation in females. So therefore, number two is the right answer. Mehosis is important because it what? What does it do? Mehosis is I use the buzzword, the keyword concept to remember it is what? Make me. How do you make yourself? They have to be garment fusion. They have to be sperm and ovary. So to make you, we need a garment. Therefore, producing identical daughters is not making a garment. Reducing chromosome normal to make what? Garment. We are not repairing DNA and we are not synthesizing DNA. You see how you can use the mnemonic to answer them. Number two is your right answer. Like I said, rapid fire, rapid fire, rapid fire. A blood type, phenotype of what? Genotype AABB is what? This is straightforward. Don't worry about it. A, A, A will divide into what? A and B will divide into B. Therefore, we have AB. But if you don't know how to do that, this is my mnemonic. Both letters, both antigens. If you have both letters, you're supposed to have both antigens. Therefore, it's going to be AB. Crossing AA and A small a results in what? This is the same thing. There's a mnemonic, or you can do the math. If AA is crossing with A, a little a, two A's will become one A, and big A will come together from AA, and small letter A will form AA. Both of them are all AA. Therefore, all of them are A. And the key word is this. Homozygous dominant, that is AA, big dominant. And anything with the A, heterozygous uh, A, all is going to give you A. This is the mnemonic you can use when you see this crossing. This is the way to answer it. The complementary DNA strand stand for what? I give you one portion of the DNA and I give you the other. Don't memorize it. There's a key word how to answer it. And what is that? A with the T and G with the C. If you don't know that, there's a mnemonic. Always together. So A and T and great couple. Great couples are always together. You see? Great couples are always together. And therefore, if A together, T always, G is great couple, right? C, great, C, great, right? A together, T always, G couple, A together. This is your right answer. So use the mnemonic and you'll be able to give me the strand of the DNA no matter what I give you. Number 15, what is your score? I want to know. Put down in the comment. Let me know. Like I said, rapid fire. Stop the video, answer the question, and see the way I approach it. And write down the things I'm writing down. Put down in the comment which question bother you and which topic you think is disturbing you. And I'll make a video about it. 
which epithelial tissue is best suited for what? Diffusion. Diffusion need small, small, small cells. And therefore, the mnemonic is what? Squat, flat for gas. Squat, squamous, flat, thin for gas. Therefore, stratified squamous or simple squamous transition or pseudo stratified. Stratify is thicker than simple. We want a very thin cell to allow diffusion. Therefore, number two is the right answer. I'm using the keywords in the question, and that's what you should do. Don't look at the answer choice. Which organelle is the site for energy? Nucleus has nothing to do with your energy. Ribosome is involved in protein synthesis. Mitochondria is the mighty guy. Gorgi package the thing. And therefore, mighty mitochondrium is the mighty energy. And that's the right answer, number three. Functional unit of the kidney is called what? Once again, what is the key word? It's not the functional, it's the kidney. What is another word for kidney? Nephron. And that's how you answer this question. You shouldn't make it difficult. Nephron, nef for nephron means kidney. And therefore, number two is your right answer. 18, during which phase of the cell cycle does DNA replication occur? Replication, cell cycle, division. And the key word is what? Division. Synthesizing is where we divide things. And therefore, we make a copy of the DNA. And that is the S. S phase is that. 18 questions. What is your score? I would like to know. Put that in the comments. Let me know which question was bothering you. But this is rapid fire. We're trying to see if you're ready for anatomy, physiology portion of the T's exams. I said this similar to what you will see on the, uh, on the T's. Which component of blood are directly involved in clotting? Don't get trapped. There's the key. The big word is what? Clotting. And clotting need what? Platelet? And the key word is what? Platelet form a plug. When you catch yourself, you have a platelet forming the plug. And then the fibrin finishes it. The fibrin finishes it. This is the buzzword to know what is involved in clotting. Red cell is no platelet or fibrin. Platelet is a platelet. White cell is no platelet or fibrin. Fibrinogen is a fibrin. Plasma protein is part of the uh, uh, fibrin product. Therefore, what is your right answer? Platelet, fibrinogen, and plasma protein. One last question. What is your score? I know you get 20 out of 20. The type of cartilage find in intervertebral discs. If, if you don't know what is intervertebral discs, this is what is in your spine. If you look at your back, you have the bones, the vertebrae, and these has to be stabilized. And in between them, there's a disc. These discs has to be very, very strong. Therefore, what do you think? How do you answer this question? There's a buzzword for that keyword. F for firm and fiber. F for firm and fiber. Strong support. There's no hyaline. We saw hyaline is the airline. It makes the bone smooth, right? Elastic makes it stretches. Therefore, it has to be what? Fibrocartilage. Articular cartilage is usually between two joints in your elbow, in your knees, and other things. Fibrocartilage has to be strong to support your spine. 20 question. Rapid fire, these anatomy, physiology, and biology, the most commonly tested questions on topics you will see. Good luck. If you like this video, comment, subscribe for more content like that. Take care of yourself and watch the questions I've already made in the playlist on the thesis. Anatomy and physiology. Take care. Bye.